hey guys so today we'll see how to download and install the git bash so for that go to the uh, site git scmcom or download or even if you write on google git bash then this will lead you to this site then here you will have the options like mac windows solaris and linux so as per your operating system you can choose the option but like i have the windows option so i will click on this one download for windows and it says like you're downloading it starting okay so by default it is installing for the 64 bits so i have the 64 bits so this is fine for me but if you have the 32 bit then you can also download from uh, clicking this link right so just save this So once it is downloaded, then click on the exe which you have downloaded. Next, then next, then next. Okay, don't create a start menu folder. Next, use git from. So it is asking two options like use git from git bash only and use git from windows command prompt. So it's uh, better if you do this one from git bash only. So, uh, okay, we'll, we'll do from git bash. So click on next one and click on next. Check out the windows style. Yes, that's fine. Yep. Okay, so it's asking that Git Bash will use the Mintity as terminal emulator, which supports a resizable windows, non rectangular selection, or if you want the uh, default console window as the windows, right? So okay, let's let's be the Mintity by. Okay, click on install. Okay, now launch Git Bash. Uh, there is no need of this one click on finish okay so now it has launched so like you can give some command or oh, let's check that where you are so let's say okay so we are here so it means that is a git bash terminal and now you can uh, you can execute whatever operation you want from the git bash and git bash is very useful uh, when you use the git commands right so when we'll use in the uh, uh, in the builds in the git builds then we will use the git bash so thanks for watching the video and please subscribe the channel for more such videos